What's going on, YouTube? Um, it's been quite a while since I posted a, uh, a video. Just wanted to catch you guys up with uh, what's been going on with myself and leave you guys with a few uh, few things here. Um, yeah, it's it's been quite a while since I posted a video. Um, so a few things I want to talk about today. First of all, um, I did get a new full-time teaching job teaching elementary, middle, and high school band. Um, at multiple locations, we're partly in person and partly online. So, um, the past, this past semester has been my first experience of what my new job is like, of what it's like being a full time uh, band director, and uh, my life definitely looks different. It looks different for multiple reasons. One, because of COVID. Two, because I have a new full time teaching job. And three, my freelance career has um, definitely been subsidized. At least, um, it's not that it's not it's not that it's non-existent. It is definitely still there. But um, my main um, kind of go-to thing now is is teaching band. Um, that's not to say that my freelance career is I'm gonna just toss away. That's totally not true. Um, I'm, as you guys will see, I'm gonna be posting. A lot of footage um, soon here and uh, the reason I haven't been posting is because that is literally how busy I've been um, I've been so busy and exhausted and stressed and um, the the new job has definitely taken a toll on me so I'm learning how to cope with it and also kind of keep up with trombone also and, and many other things but just to kind of give you guys a heads up um, I am going to be posting a lot of footage. Um, I do still have gigs, but there's two reasons why they have diminished. One, because of COVID, and two, I am now full-time. And the weird thing is, when I explain this to people, they say, oh, don't worry, it'll the gigs will pick back, pick back up. Yes, that is true, um, but I made a self-conscious decision that when I took this job, to put my freelance on the back burner. I quit like 15 bands I was playing in or something like that. Um, only because of this reason. I teach during the week, full time, I get home, I'm exhausted. Um, and then I also have a brass coaching job on Saturdays, which leaves Sundays open. And I asked myself the question, do I wanna be gigging in a bar on a Sunday night or do I wanna be at home recouping um, and resting so that I have energy to give my students and I made the decision to you know not say yes to everything anymore I feel like that time in my life is is now behind me and I'm only taking specific gigs now that's not to say I'm not still gigging um as you got like I said earlier I'm gonna be posting lots of footage um but yeah I'm even gonna be posting some footage of my uh of my band students which I have permission to do um, so you guys can look forward to that. You can see see how they sound and see me conducting. Um, but don't get me wrong. I love my new job. It's been such a blessing um, for, for many reasons. It's had some struggles mostly because um, in my life, I've when it comes to band, I have been part-time. Always part-time. So I have room to do other things. This is my first full-time band teaching job, which I feel like I'm going to have for quite a long time. So it, it's been a huge transitional year for me, just, just in general. I got married last November. I got a new teaching job. We got COVID going on. So it, it's been a lot of change. But just to let you guys know, um, this doesn't mean I'm like quitting YouTube or anything, but my posts are going to be a little more sporadic than, than they used to. Um, but with that in mind, it's just, um, I'm still thankful that I have all of you subscribers that come back and check up on me and uh, listen to my trombone playing and all that stuff. Um, moving on to my next topic, um, I, do ha I do still have room for private students. So if you play trombone or any brass or woodwind instrument and you feel like you can learn something from me, um, there's a link in the description you can check out um, and... You can contact me. We can talk about rates and all, all of those details. But um, all the students I've gotten so far from you two have been 
have made a lot of progression and they all have great testimonials. Um, another thing I want to talk about, my kind of tip of the day besides checking in on me is teaching band has taught me a lot of things. It's actually helped me in my trombone playing because there's nothing like internalizing a concept like teaching it. It's one thing to be able to do it. It's one thing to be able to teach it. And the one thing that all my students have noticed, the one thing that I end up coming back to is time. Is time. It's like you can play all of these notes and, you know, they they think they know everything. And, oh, I can play da-da-da. I can play all the chromatic, you know, everything. But if it's not in time, here's the thing. Time is what allows us to play music together if we're out of time everything is out of sync um so my kind of tidbit for the day is when you're practicing especially now because there's not a lot of performing going on be sure you're practicing with the metronome because the minute you start playing with an ensemble and you still have that soloist mentality you begin to drop the ball and i will also say that playing music is more gratifying when you play in time. So there's my tip of the day. Play with the metronome. Um, guys, I'm super stoked. I've got lots of footage coming. Just wanted to come on here and let you guys know what I've been up to and give you a little tidbit. Um, but like I said, I'm going to be posting a bunch of footage. I've got some social media stuff. I've got a few gigs I played. I've got some footage of my band kids. So be prepared for Nathan Fulmizi trombone YouTube spam. Um, and feel free to comment and like it guys. Thanks for, um, all the subscribers. I'm almost to 700 subscribers. So if you guys have any ideas for a 700 subscriber special, let me know if you have any questions for me, leave them in the comments. Thanks guys. And again, you can check the link in the description for private lessons. Thank you all and happy early Merry Christmas.